How long has the uh, school been teaching technology and, and computers, robotics, that kind of thing? Well, it took quite a long time. I haven't been director then when we started, but I suppose it was somewhere in the middle of uh, the 80s or, or at the beginning or 90s. Mm -hmm. In terms of uh, uh, coursework, Every year, there's, the students are getting at uh, technology at least in one class, if not multiple classes. It, it, like, it's not always a technology course. Sometimes it's in biology. Sometimes it's in yeah, yeah. In certain classes, we have uh, we are teaching the computers mm -hmm. to the to the uh, students, but m mainly they were they learn subjects with right, right. Uh, IT techniques. Awesome. And this is a regular class they're having oh, okay. in form five. Okay. Okay. So we're here to learn all about uh, Estonia's school system and how you're integrating technologies. Uh, uh, so computers, programming, the ro we saw the robots earlier and all of that. Uh, so I guess my first question would be, so how is technology used in the classroom? Computers help uh, uh, improve the learning experience and uh, they allow us to do things that we couldn't maybe do on paper or with textbooks. We also have uh, many, um, I guess you could call it uh, thought games or contests such as chess or uh, gomoku, mm -hmm. uh, sudoku, uh, sudoku, sudoku. Yeah. that uh, we engage in tournaments online. Yeah. Oh, okay, so you yeah. use competitions yeah. with other schools and um, within the school. Yeah. Okay, so there's online groups that essentially make it so that you're not just the school, so you can yes. interact with your colleagues yeah. in, other, in other classes. Okay. So we're heading over to... Over to one of the classes, I'm not sure, I think the robotics class in grade 11. Robotics. In grade 11. Grade 11, can you imagine yeah. what those robotics Oh, well, I'm looking forward to that one. So what are you guys working on today? Uh, programming and uh, put the program into robots. How are you finding it? Pretty easy? No. No? <laughs> It's very difficult. <laughs> <laughs> is this a, a classroom Mac that you guys are using, or is this one of the ones that you have your own classroom. Mac? It's a classroom Mac. Yeah. Okay. So how long have you guys? How long have you been um, doing this? Yeah, this like robotics and that kind of thing. Like, when did you start robotics programming? Like, has it been in all the September? way? Yeah, but how, like in gr earlier grades, were you doing this too? Is this all kind of new, or did you do robotics when you were younger? Uh, no, it's all new. It's all new, yeah, yeah. because they're just bringing it into the school now, right? Yeah. yeah. Okay, so have you guys taken programming, like coding, whatever programming, before in earlier grades? No? Oh, so it's all new. So have you thought about what you want to do after school, like going to university? Have you figured out that yet? Is it robotics? I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> no? I don't know. I want to go to university, but I don't know the subject. No. OK. So you guys are uh, working on the robot here. This is your own design, basically, to totally crush the other guys in the field? You think you're going to do it? What's your, uh, what's your strategy for uh, knocking them out of the ring? Simple. Try and get their wheels off the ground. Ah, nice. So okay. They, they didn't have any power, and they just. Um, is this the first time you've been using robotics? Yeah. In terms of like throughout your school? Yeah. Yeah. Basic yeah. Okay. And what about uh, coding or programming? Have you guys been doing that in previous grades at all? No. No. Interesting, because I know that some of the earlier grades in another school, they were learning robotics, not this complicated, but in grade two they were using it. So it's, but, but it's all kind of coming into all the different grades at the same time, more or less, is it? Yeah. So you guys like this kind of thing? Yes. The hands-on? It's quite interesting. Yeah. Yeah. Have you thought about what you want to do next in terms of uh, careers or uh, university? Or college, or uh, university. Yeah, but which you know which subject you're gonna look at? Uh, no. 
body culture, body culture. Body culture. Multiculture? But is this interesting enough to think, well, maybe engineering or, or not? Yeah. Maybe something technological. Yeah, 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 okay. I guess this is the first time you guys have had uh, exposure to robotics? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. First time for programming too, or did you take any stuff earlier? No. No? no. First time. So what do you think about all of it? Cool or? Yeah. yeah. Maybe? Maybe. Yeah. Is it gonna maybe think, uh, like, what are your thoughts after, well, I mean, you get one more year, grade 12, then you go into university or college or whatever. What are your thoughts? Is this something that... No, definitely I no? not. <laughs> I should be asking these questions because so far it's like nobody's interested in robotics. <laughs> Great. <laughs> All the other guys say they're going to totally crush you guys. <laughs> get the competition going. Okay. This is the first time for robotics for you guys, Yeah. right? Um, first time programming, or did you do any programming before this? No, first time. First time? Yeah? So what do you think of it? Programming, robotics, that kind of thing. Interesting, or...? Uh, it's creative. Yeah, yeah. In terms of uh, what do you guys want to do after you graduate? Thoughts? Yeah? University. Yeah, university. Any idea what? You guys, same thing? Programming. Programming? Uh, programming, firstly. I finally got a programming guy here. Everyone else, but no, no, I don't want to program. One programmer. <laughs> so my theory is quickly crushing. But then again, this is the first time they've seen it. Yeah. First time programming, first time robotics in grade 11. That's my point. It's, it's too late. Too late, yeah. Because they're, they're, you know, they're, you know, it's interesting that, you know, talking to everyone uh, here, there was one programmer that came forward, and maybe there's maybe one other one that might be interested in it. But this is the first time the students are seeing it, and it's grade 11. Uh, so uh, pro uh, programming and robotics. So, you know, one, we got one out of how many, about 15, which is good, but it's kind of like the standard. And so the idea of, you know, if we asked the kids this morning, <laughs> they, some of them wanted to be all kinds of different things, but some of them, we had probably about the same stat just in grade two that we could probably grow over the years as so I just kind of used it and found it interesting, so. Interesting.